Hundreds of Chicago public school teachers are headed down to Springfield to demand more money for schools. They're on their way to rally at the state capitol for a day of action. Our Marissa Perlman is there and is going to talk us through what's happening this morning and what has already happened this morning. Good morning, Marissa. Good morning to both of you. Good to be with you. Yeah, we are here as five buses full of teachers and staff are here outside of CPU headquarters getting ready to make their way to Springfield today. We spoke with dozens of teachers this morning who tell us they want to make Chicago schools fully funded. This is a bus packed full of teachers right here. Now, right now, the state law state lawmakers are in their final days of budget talks for the next fiscal year. One teacher from every district run school will head to Springfield on approved release today. Now, last week, CPS sent parents a letter about today's day of action because they say what the state is offering would create a $400 million deficit. The teachers union plans to ask for $1 billion more in funding. Now, here's where we stand now. Illinois currently offers up $14 billion for all schools. That's grades K through 12. The latest budget plan would add 500 million more. Now, what's not clear is if Mayor Brandon Johnson would propose a tax hike today. We're going to hear from uh, some staff and teachers here about their message in just a few minutes from now. What is motivating the, them to take the day off, head to Springfield, and uh, participate in this day of action? We'll be sure to bring you their message as soon as we speak with them. For now, we're live at CPU headquarters. I'm Marissa Perlman, CBS 2 News. All right, Marissa, stand on top of that. Thank you. Up